This is a patient who had both knees scanned, and they have something called mucoid degeneration of the anterior cruciate ligament. So it's a good example of a normal versus abnormal um, ACL. And so the anterior cruciate ligament comes from the back of the femur. This is the femur, the back of it here, down to the front of the tibia. The tibia is below the knee joint. And the anterior cruciate ligament and the posterior cruciate ligament make this little X. This is the PCL going this direction, and then the opposite direction is the ACL. And this is a normal orientation. It's very tall, straight up and down. And if we look on the opposite knee in the same patient, we see the ACL. It doesn't look quite right. Instead of being nice and dark like over here, it's expanded diffusely, and it has very bright signal within it, almost like fluid. This is fluid in the front and back, but not quite that bright. And the longitudinal fibers of the ACL, if we look carefully, these linear strands are intact. We just have this um, bright material between the longitudinal fibers. And this is, this is what they call mucoid degeneration of the ACL. It's not disrupted. It's just expanded with this mucous material and it fills up the central joint like this. A uh, nice example of mucoid degeneration of the ACL. Oftentimes you also have little erosions where the ACL attaches, sometimes on the femur, sometimes on the tibial side, and that's it.